Um, pros, this is Mike with another dirty promotion video. I'm gonna tint a vehicle here on 4th of July. Uh, Felicia, the tint queen, this guy, this uh, gal, this vehicle got away from you, man, and America's Dairyland. I didn't know you guys had a lot of milk out there, but anyway, and also funny characters. Look at that. Pretty cute. Anyway, this uh, video is also dedicated to Mary Dunham High, who is a great follower. As I can see that she said that she wanted me to go ahead and rock the dirty tank. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. It's actually right here, my tank. But it's actually on a reel and the reel is on a tank here, five gallon. It's really on my portable jig and I don't use it to do a lot of videos because a lot of people don't have this complicated fancy ass rig. So it doesn't make sense for me to try and demonstrate something with something that's not realistic. So my realistic thing is really to do the air peel around the vehicle or stuff that helps pros out with whatever uh, environment you're already working with, right? So anyway, um, I saw right away when I was doing this, uh, this thing, this preparation, initially it had a little bit of the hydrophobic thing, but I guess it was just a dirty window, right? Okay, so let's go ahead and get started and uh, we'll see uh, another friend of mine from Florida. I doesn't want to be named, so I will not name him. He says he, uh, he's been uh, doing, uh, you know, uh, other things, but, but not uh, bottom loading. So he tried to do bottom loading according to my videos and it was, uh, you know, it's kind of like you're doing something for two decades or so and then you try to do something else and it's kind of like, fuck man, I, I can't get used to this air peel. So this video is also for that gentleman, Miss Mary, uh, Mary Dunham High, and of course for Felicia, the Tint Queen Grunau from Sticky Tints who uh, let this car get away. Oh, by the way, the, the uh, customer said that the uh, film over there is very expensive, so might be you know cost of living stuff you know cost of living over here we are really uh right next to mexico actually if you fucking throw a stone here in my area you probably hit a beaner you know oh there across the border i mean we're that close to the border so let's go ahead and just do this thing it's not my normal speed but i'm trying to get all my thoughts in and all the uh, people that i'm trying to tag and stuff like that i'm gonna be using uh Tint Slime Ultra, I'd never use the green stuff original. I'd like, you know, my fucking humid 100 degree days and all that kind of stuff is really calls for something, uh, uh, a product that really like fucking floats, moving, whatever, okay? So that'll be what I'm gonna be using. Bottom loading, okay, that's what I wanna to talk to, I almost forgot. If I do a bottom load, me like, it'll be a no touch film, meaning I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go ahead and do this and not touch the film. Now I put my hands like that. You know, I think if you see all my, you know, bottom loading videos, you're never gonna see me do this because when you're at this angle, it's really awkward to do this bullshit, okay? I also am one of the guys that hate, if I'm gonna bottom load, I'm already doing something to not touch film. So I'm not gonna be doing this, like touching the fucking film and all that, no. Bottom loading means that you're gonna do a fucking, you remove sweep, you went through all the hassle of doing that. I even removed the lip because it's very easy. This stupid little, where is it? Here. This thing was very easy to remove. Remove it, drop your film. This is computer cut Lumar. So to me, it's like if I'm going to do an air peel, I'm going to do it like this, manage it, go like this, you know, like a fucking zombie or Frankenstein. And, and then when I'm here, then I can kind of start doing this with my fingers to manage. And in all these types of windows, the shorter part of the window are the ones that I like to feed in first, I like to feed it. And then kind of like, if I feed it that way, then this drops. If I try to go straight, I'm always gonna be fucking touching this or touching this, which to me is like, why the fuck did I go through all the dropping my film if I'm gonna go and fuck it up by touching the sides? Contaminate. The reason of a two stage is because you don't wanna remove or you don't know how to or whatever, it doesn't matter. And then you contaminate here and crease and dirt and fucking ant lines or whatever they call them, you know, fucking all this kind of stuff, right? So. If you do air peel, we're gonna do it in such a way that also pay a lot of fucking attention. Like if you're doing this and looking over there and you're fucking filming stick here, all, all your hard work is fucking down the toilet, seriously. So anyway, without further ado, just watch, listen to it. Remember, go back to this fucking video, look at it 3000 times like you know a lot of my followers do and say, man, I fucking learned so much. Thank you for letting me know. I, it doesn't mean a lot to me because my work is not being done in vain then, you know, if you guys are following it, really paying attention and actually practicing what I, 
what I preach, right? Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Let's see if we can, uh, well, actually, I'm going to go ahead and just do all this thing. And let me start getting concentrated because I'm losing my fucking train of thought. Okay, this motherfucker all the way to the bottom. All this liquid. Now, one of the important things about bottom loading, and, I, and me, even with fucking three decades of bullshitting with this, I forgot to actually go a little bit deeper down. Please, when you're cleaning, this is not your limit, bro. Your limit is like fucking four inches below that because when you drop film, you're dropping and you're letting go of like three, two, two inches, whatever. If you don't clean the fucking bottom thing, and if you think that doing this, here is Mary uh, Dunham High. If you think you're doing this and that's, nah, man, there's shit that's stuck on the glass, man, that you never touch or clean. So use a longer instrument that might actually affect the touch and then do whatever else you're going to do, right? I think that, that's what's called for. So anyway, let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to do this to the bottom. Two, three, four inches, whatever. We're good there. Get this out of the way. Okay. Now we're ready to go ahead and start doing the top portion. Little bevel. Clean it, go around, not just fucking touch this, this bullshit around. Because water is gonna go here and then slowly come down. And if you have a lot of shit on your lip here, not your physical lip, but this lip right here, it's because the shit that's lit there just comes down with the water down here. So do that, one pass and that's it. Don't go back and forth and that's it, man. Oh, sorry about the, uh, the bottle I'm supposed to. This is video for Mary Dunham High. She wants to see this bad boy in action. So let's go ahead and do that. This guy right here, here, okay. Touchy, no touching. 100% coverage so that you're always gonna have real good slip of the film. Put it under, hands, and do everything like real quick because you know the least amount of time you are in the air fucking around with the film, uh, no contaminants from the air falling into your film. And there it is. That's just the way that you're supposed to make that cookie roll. Here's your top gap from a computer perspective. It's good enough. Looks really good. And of course, I think distribution, I've always talked about, you know, center, this way, this way. Don't do this and this, because if you didn't remove the sweep, you're gonna have a fuckload of fingers. And that's it, bro. That's all she wrote. I'm just gonna finish this off. And I thank all the followers for looking at this video on this very important 4th of July. I know you guys are gonna get shit faced like me later on. Happy 4th of July. And guys, enjoyed you following the video. And that's pretty much, I'm just going to wrap it up here. Uh, edges, edges. All the way up. You know, do your bottom thing. Real easy, man. I mean, easy as fuck if you ask me. I mean, uh, that's the reason that I bottom load because of ease. But if I bottom load and then touch the shit and touch this and touch that or fucking do this with the hands... I really pretty much have defeated the fucking reason why we bottom load. Guys, have a great day. GoPro, stop recording.